Great coaches are also coachable, and there's many reasons why executives get executive coaching. Here's the top three. Number one, increase clarity and focus. Sometimes we're just too involved, just too close, and it's hard to work on your business when you're too busy working in it. Also, increased accountability. It's so easy to make excuses for yourself, and sometimes you need someone who won't let you off the hook. And then finally, but not all, increased confidence. Our negative self-talk is one of our biggest inhibitors to our success, and a coach can help us identify and confront our shortcomings. You have to go back a few steps versus forward to get to where you need to be. So in this particular case, the original plan that you had when Vision when you saw me came in here is exactly what I saw on that stage. How you brought it on that stage is the same way you bring it here. It doesn't change. How you do anything is how you do everything, so do anything that you do in excellence, right? So at your fullest potential, you were, that's what you want to do. That's what you do right here. That empties all the other places out. What you do on that stage is what needs to happen every single day in your business. Max out your gift wherever you're at, which I know you already do. But sometimes we can be like, oh man, this is a, you know, it's a job. I mean, and, and, and I can't wait till I get to my thing, but what, no. Maxes out as if there's no tomorrow, and then everything that you're looking for comes out of it. Ohio City Burrito only uses the freshest ingredients, and they cook their food from scratch every day. One of their taglines is they're actually able to serve their customers food that's healthy but actually tastes good. This starts, of course, with the fresh ingredients. From the tender beef shoulder to the all white meat chicken breast, all hand rubbed with a unique blend of spices and oven roasted to tenderness. So they can be hand pulled for making their way to the menu. All the sauces are made from scratch every day using fresh produce. They believe that preparing all food fresh every day provides their customers with a great experience. What'd you guys think of that place? Yeah, it was amazing. They give it to Chipotle a room for their money. Five. That's why Chipotle's not here on West 25th Street. Yeah, right. Because we got Ohio City burrito and they just uh, they just tore it up. So I uh, got myself a burrito with barbacoa, with some habanero hot sauce and some jalapenos and all the beans and everything they had on there. And I rank it high. I thought it was really good. So I had chicken, barbacoa, and shrimp. I like their seasoning. Their seasoning is really good. And that's what you should, when you go to anything that have to do with, I think the whole culture when they're doing burritos and stuff like that, it should have the seasoning. Stay tuned for the next spot. We don't know where it's gonna be, but we thought that today would be Ohio City Burrito up here on West 25th, and uh, we'll see where we roll next time, huh? Yep, great selection, Donnie. Check it out. <laughs> All right.